Okay, now, as you're working your way up, I don't care if you're working at a hospital, working in their security or their safety department, working for a contract security department, you need to start focusing on developing a career, a solid resume and curriculum vitae, and an excellent reputation. While you communicate with people, you will need to develop a humble, confident, and appreciative attitude. That means, if you do things like you call them people bro, dog, or any nickname that puts them on a low-key level, this is seen as you trying to put yourself on their level. And that can be seen and most often is seen as disrespectful or very unprofessional. So stop doing that. If you're in management and you have employees that do that, coach them not to do that. This isn't about being real or making people feel better about themselves. Coach them so that if they're making 15 bucks an hour today, next week they can make 20. Or their next job, they can make 30. Or they can get out of that whole thing and start earning contract type of money. Here's a real life pattern that's being observed. One, uh, actually, this is a very respected guy on the East Coast. He reported that he was starting to see a trend with the way people send him messages and contact him looking for work. They send messages with, hey bro, or what up, or you hiring? If you've done this in the past, don't do this anymore. If you know of people that approach their career like that, let them know that they're just digging a hole for themselves and they're making everything very, very difficult. The competitive nature of this industry is the real deal so you need to actually you don't need to i'm just telling you if you act as a professional you will get paid as a professional and you will be respected as a professional if you act like someone right out of high school that's the kind of money you're going to bring in and that's the kind of respect you're going to gain